What do we do with the drunken sailor? What do we do with the drunken sailor? What do we do with the drunken sailor early in the morning? Hi, I'm Maurice Tanney, and this is another episode of Acoustic Guitars Campfire Songs. We're going to take a classic, familiar song and work out a simple, single guitar arrangement suitable for a beginner to tackle or a more advanced player to have in their back pocket when you're sitting around with a group of friends and someone thrusts the guitar in your hand and insists you play something we can all sing together. <laughs> group singing. Some songs really are better than others for group singing, and there are some songs that are just made for it, and not always for fun. Sea shanties are generally considered 19th century shipboard work songs that are descendant of two primary sources, one being earlier 18th century work chants used by European sailors to coordinate certain tasks that required all hands on deck. The other source being the traditional work songs sung by African and African American laborers. The era of sea shanties as we know them today began in the early 1800s, reached its peak on sailing ships in the 1870s, and died pretty quickly with the eventual switch to engine power, which required far less coordinated manual labor on deck. Drunken Sailor, or Up She Rises, as it is also known, is one of the most familiar of all the sea shanties. There's not a lot to learn with Drunken Sailor. With some light digging, you can find some more ornate arrangements, but our campfire version is the traditional, simple, four-bar pattern using just three chords. A minor, a G, and a C. I'm going to use a simple finger-picking pattern for this song. What do we do with the drunken sailor? What do we do with the drunken sailor? What do we do with the drunken sailor early in the morning? While the point of the song was originally to get the work done, today the heart of the song is really in the joy of group singing and the colorful early morning treatments the singers are suggesting for their compromised colleague. I'm going to do just a few of the more familiar verses, but this is a song that has had centuries to develop variations and alternate lyrics. Vary as they may, they generally stick to a theme of dissuading a sailor of returning from shore with any number of his sheets to the wind. You should find no shortage of body variants on the verses, and I'll leave it to you to draw the line of appropriateness for yourself. By the way, the verse featuring the captain's daughter, it's actually a reference to the Cat of Nine Tales. So what do we do with a drunken sailor? <laughs> What do we do with the drunken sailor? What do we do with the drunken sailor? What do we do with the drunken sailor early in the morning? Way and up she rises, way and up she rises, way and up she rises early in the morning. Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Put him in the longboat till he's sober early in the morning. Way and up she rises. Way and up she rises. Way and up she rises early in the morning. Put him in the hole with the captain's daughter. Put him in the hole with the captain's daughter. Put him in the hole with the captain's daughter early in the morning. Way and up she rises. Way and up she rises. Way and up she rises early in the morning. What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? Way and up she rises, way and up she rises, way and up she rises early in the morning.